Well, I guess that's a good start. <laughs> My friend already died. <laughs> What happened? <laughs> what happened? <laughs> what did I see? Or Dovis. <laughs> Hi. Place. Place. And stuff began. Fall. Fall on me. <laughs> And stuff begin to fall on me. <laughs> uh, well, I'm gonna have to give some of her stuff back. <laughs> I just started record recording. <laughs> That's perfect. <laughs> Do you? I don't swear. Okay, that was a perfect start. So, anyways, welcome to Minecraft Multiplayer with Corvobus. She can't really hear me right now because, uh... I've done stuff with cursing so you know, be fine I've done stuff with cursing so you'll be fine and would you look at that we managed to make it out of the canyon just normal recording Okay. I've never really done a multiplayer series except with my cousin, and this is actually a friend I know on another place. She likes some privacy, so I can't really reveal too much. So, yeah. Here's my house. <laughs> I decided to build it at the canyon. It looks like she's off to grab some of that stuff. Meanwhile, I need to prepare to move in because I have yet to build a furnace, which is really important right now. We actually had another world before this, but my phone stopped working with Minecraft. Since my Season 4 world is on the phone, that means Season 4 has been cut short, too. I should be able to get some coal, right? Smelt up some this iron. 
<laughs> there was coal down here. Do you have any extra coal? Do you have any extra coal? Oh, cool. I need it for... I need it to smelt iron. By the way, there's like a butt ton of iron in this place. The torts! Torts lava. Not towards lava. Thanks. Not towards lava. Okay. Also, look at the staircase of death 2.0. And I just noticed this out of the. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? What happened? <laughs> also, welcome to my very skinny canyon house. Spider was desperately trying to crawl it. <laughs> well, okay then. I just need to save some for torches. Okay. <coughs> Already enough for a bucket. So I can collect some water. <coughs> I'm probably going to build a farm down here. Oh. Hi. <coughs> but it tied in the lava. <coughs> <clears throat> Let's put some torches up here in the middle, and let's place some torches on each one of these corners. Steel. Do you mean iron? Steel, do you mean iron? <laughs> okay. So now, hopefully, I can make some sticks. <clears throat> Boom. Place my weapon and let's put this pickaxe here. <clears throat> oh boy. What are you feeling? 
That is right above lava, so I am not going to risk that. <sighs> I'm off to the shack to see if we left anything there. I'm off to the shack to see if we left anything there. <laughs> I would try not to. I would try not to. <laughs> I died of starvation earlier. And I think I will again. God, I need food. Uh, oh, bread, bread, bread. That's probably from my friend, but I don't really care. What's up? <laughs> I told Salty Loser she. What the? <gasps> oh my god, that's a freaking husk. I've never seen one of these. I was just. I was just attacked. By a husk. I was just attacked by a husk. <clears throat> okay. I just realized I left all my carrots and stuff here. So I might want to grab some water. Oh, and then there's my melon. Melon! Did I seriously get no seeds from that? Look, well, well, there goes our melon. Hi, mister. Well, one thing's for sure, I left something here. That's an. I just saw another freaking husk. Okay. Another? Another husk? Oh great, husks give you hunger when they attack you. I can only imagine what that censored word is. Where are you? What the? Oh. Bunnies? Oh, they're attracted to carrots. I have bunnies following me. And I think I know why and I think I know why Jump down into my base. Ooh, that was bad. Uh. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> I got a potato. <laughs> uh. And I died. And I died. <laughs> I died. 
and I died. <laughs> <laughs> Was she seriously so distracted by that freaking potato? <laughs> well, I guess I can't drop down. <laughs> <laughs> At least they don't have to worry about hunger again. <laughs> Oop, nope. Yeah, oh boy. This is fun. This is fun for the whole freaking family. There might be more people joining this world, though. That's the great part about this series. This must be the whole bound to... Yep, there's the, there's the staircase of doom. <clears throat> and... Is that, uh, it's seriously on my roof. <clears throat> How do I lose an iron pickaxe every time, every time I have a freaking iron, every time I freaking have iron tools, I think they, I think they just automatically get attracted to the lava. Where are my iron tools? <sighs> Guys, can you explain to me why I always my iron tools are always missing? Where are my iron tools? I have my stone tools, but... At least I still have my bucket of water. That, that thing's important. I can tell you now that that's important. Okay. To, to build a place where I'm gonna put all my farming stuff. Okay, I was about to say, thought I lost my dirt. Because if I did lose my dirt, I would be super mad. Boom. Okay. Oh no! No, the carrots disappeared. Are you freaking kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me? Yep, they're not here. Ugh. Uh. God dang it. Is there like another ledge up there I can mine up to? First off, how did my iron tools get all the way up there? Second off, I found, I found it. The items somehow got 
on top of a higher ledge. building a house too. Hold on. Okay, it kicked me out when entering Discord. 
great. Oh yeah, sometimes Minecraft does not like it when Discord's running at the same time. Okay. about kicking you out. Okay. Just making sure, can you hear me? Can you hear me? Say in chat, Ooga Booga, if you can hear me. Well, why did I build this staircase there if there was literally a hole that leads right to where you were? <laughs> Whoa! Where did you get that hat? Can you hear me? Ooh. Ooh. I guess she's busy. I'll come back later. <sighs> okay, so. <sighs> I am hungry. I'm gonna get me some food.
Um, dum 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 Okay. Yummy, yummy for my tummy, tummy. Okay. Uh, I can't reach it. Oh, well. At least I can get some. My iron pickaxe is not here. Well, it's despawned by now, so... Yeah. Ugh. At least we have like six billion iron cooking in the furnace. Boom. So it won't matter how many times I have to replace this iron pickaxe. As long as we have the iron in this canyon for it. Okay, I'm gonna get this redstone. Okay, oh. Okay then, try. Try headphone. Microphone should be crossed out. And headphones shouldn't. Okay. So first off, I am going to mine this redstone. There we go. Yeah, baby. Oh, yeah. Yeah, baby. If you can hear me, Karobis, type in chat, Oogala Boogala. If you can hear me, type in the chat. Oogala Boogala. You know, 
if you can hear me. <sighs> Hold on. You might get kicked out again. Bum 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 ba bum bum. Huh. Oops. Hello, welcome back. That took longer than usual, but she says she can hear me, so. And okay, woo. Minecraft's loud. Okay. Okay. So when you need to tell me something, just tell me in Minecraft. Okay. The world is up. I'm going to go ahead and invite you back. And we're good to go. Hopefully. Hopefully, hopefully. Okay. You spawned in, but where are you? Oh, 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 jeez. <laughs> you scared me half to death. <laughs> I play a lot of horror games. Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, that would have been more funny. If you scared me so bad, I moved backwards so far that I fell off and into the canyon. By the way, I'm about to create the door that, um, that just basically leads down into the canyon. That's gonna be funny. spot for it. There we go. <laughs> oh, God dang it. I'm going to have to place in the door from the inside. Just put the floor down first, and then add the door. 
get out of the room before I break the block underneath me because I don't want to fall to my doom. And there we go. <laughs> I'm doing I'm just doing this for giggles. I'm actually gonna test it, so I'm gonna make a chest. Wait. Gervobus, did you bring the chest? I'm gonna need it. I'm gonna test the door. Oh. Did you seriously leave it back at the shack? <laughs> no? Oh, it's right here. Well, okay then. Just so you know, my stuff is going in here. And for some reason, my tablet is so stupid that it is forcing me to put in the items one at a time. Apparently, the holding and putting them all at once doesn't work on this. Which, of course, sucks. Especially when I have to put up 38 cobblestone stairs and 28 cobblestone fences. I'm actually going to take random junk with me I don't need. Ooh. Like these wooden swords. And these wooden axes. Why am I putting that wooden sword back in the chest? We're going to need wool. Oh yeah, I made a ton of torches if you need them. Well good, I put 35 of them in the chest. Enjoy yourself. I also got some redstone. I filled up the chest to the I filled the chest up to the brim with my stuff that I need. I'm taking the wooden tools and stuff because we don't really need them anymore. Oh. I was running into a wall. Yeah. <laughs> For fuel? There's no room in the chest. And I'm... And I was already just about to jump it. There isn't any room for the chest. Okay. And here we go. Oh god, that's bad. I put the door right above water. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't see it because it was so freaking dark. Uh, <laughs> uh, wow. <laughs> I didn't see because it, it was so dark. I might need to grab a torch and some blocks so I can plug up the hole of water. That way I can actually die in the darn thing. <laughs> oh boy, here's the fun moment of where I have to put in cobblestone blocks back into my inventory. One by one. At least I don't have to put in like 50,000 stacks of it. I also need a torch. Actually, I'll grab one from one of the fences because there's way too many torches up here. Okay. 
let's see. There's okay. Okay, 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 okay. Swim them up. Swim, swim. Just keep swimming, just keep swimming, just keep swimming, just keep swimming, just keep swimming. Is there seriously more water? Are you kidding me? Oh my god, there are like five streams up here. Okay. There we go. Okay, I've made an area of land where when you hit the ground, you'll probably die or at least have low health. And it's very dark down there, so it's possible that moths will spawn down there and end you if you survive it. Okay. Whoa. I got scared by a stare. Wow. <laughs> I swear, I get scared by some of the stupidest things. Okay, I don't really care if I take the cobblestone with me on this trip. I warned you about the stairs, bro. Whee! Yay, it worked! And I forgot we didn't sleep in bed, so I spawned back at the spawn point where there are like 50,000 monsters out here because it's nighttime. Oh dear. <laughs> How did I kill that skeleton? Or whatever, uh. <laughs> That's like a classic from SpongeBob. <laughs> Okay. That's a classic in general. Yes. <laughs> okay. Okay. I can see my experience that I've lost from dying glowing in the dark. I'm going to get the wooden tools and cobblestone back. Oh, by the way, every time someone new enters this server, I'm going to... I'm going to have them... jump down. That's going to be the first thing they're going to do when they enter the server. <laughs> so warning if you guys join me. It might not live for a few seconds. It might not last a minute. I has a potato. <laughs> Do you English, bruh? The Irish part of me is happy. I'm part Dutch. Yeah. Ooh! I'm meeting someone whose family is pretty much from the Netherlands area. Ancestors are from Netherlands. 
in Belgium. Because both of those places are considered Dutch. Okay. Time to do the painful process of grabbing my stuff one piece at a time. Oh yeah, I left you your map because apparently you gave it to me. I'm going to take some of the torches. I'm going to take these bones. I'm going to take the sugar cane. And the bucket. I'll leave you the mutton. Because I don't know how your hunger bar is. Your sugar cane? Wait, that's yours? Well, I was going to start up a farm and plant it. Huh. I'm going to start up the farm, though. I'm just going to need... Oh, I'm just going to fix... I apparently fell off the staircase of doom. Nice. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> I'm just gonna need to grab some dirt real quick. That way I can start. I might need to grab some more water too. I'm gonna need to make an infinite water source here in a minute. Because, uh, that's gonna be useful. So let's see. Grabbing some dirt. So, it's so funny listening to Minecraft. Someone saying, okay, I'm off to get some dirt. <laughs> Like, that's something you don't normally, um, uh, hear in Minecraft. Hey, uh, it's not, I'm off to get some diamonds, or I'm off to get some iron, it's, I'm off to get some dirt. <laughs> <laughs> this hole in the ground where the staircase is at, it looks like a cross. <laughs> I'm, I'm to get some sand. <laughs> yeah. We're right underneath the desert biome. I think sand's not gonna sand's not gonna be a problem. <laughs> Get dang it, stuck on a wall. Ooh, some of the carrots grew. Nice. Okay. Going to dismantle this makeshift farm I have and turn it into an infinite water source. Boom, baby. I think I'm gonna do a sugar cane on the inside. By the way, sugar cane can grow on dirt too. What's up with dirt today? Reminds me of that Markiplier video. Hey, um, have you seen some dirt? It looks like, um, you know, dirt. It's brown and it's on the ground because, you know, it's dirt. <laughs> <laughs> that Markiplier video. You know, it's in the ground. It actually is the ground, because you know it's dirt. <laughs> okay, this right here is going to be the carrot farm. And since it's an infinite water source, I can just grab water and go. Now we don't have to go all the way back up there or go all the way down there to the bottom of the canyon to get water. Okay. Sugar cane actually grows faster in sand, so... Do you mind getting a ton of sand for the sugar cane? I'm actually going to have like a big line of water and have like sand on both sides and start, um... You found a temple! You mean like a desert temple? 
don't go into it yet because um desert temples explode if you activate the trap like in the middle of the desert temple if you dig down there's treasure underneath it but if you do it incorrectly and have like a block land on the pressure plate down there the treasure will blow up along with the bottom of the temple you'll be safe if you don't fall down but yeah we really need the treasure so wait for me to come up there unless you've already activated the, the pressure plate and Luckily, I have an iron sword and some of the wooden swords. I also have some iron, but... I also have some iron, but I really want to take out this desert temple. I've taken out many desert temples before. And let me tell you, they're a real pain in the butt to take down. Okay, so where is this desert temple you're talking about? I should know what it looks like when I see it, because desert temples are the exact same every time. Uh, 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 oh, there you are. Oh, just right across there. Okay. It's Kever there. Don't you mean over? I noticed that sometimes there, there's like a massive difference between my typing and other people's typing. I have like good punctuation. Not perfect grammar though, but pretty decent punctuation. Okay, I'm going in. Wait, do I have some torches? I'm going to need to light it up. There we go. Heading in. Ooh. Light it up, light it up, light it up, light it up, light the darn thing up, light it up, light it up, light it up. How come there are no monsters here? I think it's safe for you to come in because there are literally no monsters here. <laughs> I was expecting one heck of a fight because normally there are like six. Okay, don't mind down yet. I am actually going to build a staircase down because, like I said, there's a pressure plate at the bottom, and if you push it, the treasure and all the bottom goes down with it. Don't come down yet until I take down the No! The torch just landed on top of the pressure plate. Wait. Oh my god. Did it just miss it? Oh. My god. No, it didn't. Thank. Okay. The pressure plate has been removed. You can come down now. Let's see what loot we got. Okay, a ton of sand. That's actually pretty useful for the sugarcane farm we're working on. Some gold. Uh, one piece of iron in this chest, or some gold in that chest. Gunpowder. Iron and golden horse armor. Some string, which would be useful for wool. There's also a bunch of rotten flesh. Uh, bones. <gasps> a saddle! Oh my god. It also sucks that I'm having to pick out these things. What's in that chest? Oh, you emptied it out? What was in it? Oh, you're opening that chest to... Do we really need the rotten flesh? 
I mean, it, no, it's not, you know. I also got some orange terracotta from that. Ooh, sorry. Which means orange clay. They keep renaming the hardened clay over and over again. Yes, grab the chest. And there we go, we've conquered, uh... We've conquered a desert temple. Somehow, with no monsters in it. Now, the biggest thing about this is... I am getting out of here. Because I don't want to jinx myself. Okay. We've conquered a desert temple. Which I've done many times before. And look at that. Sugar cane. I found some more. Ooh. Like, what kind of stuff did we get? You said some good stuff, but what kind? Are they? Is there like gold? Diamonds, emeralds, what kind of stuff? I don't think that I don't think we really got much good stuff because there were literally no monsters. I'm also running back to the house real quickly. Also, I can see where you've been digging sand. There's just like a big line of sand missing from in the ground. <laughs> okay. Watch this, I hurt myself again. Okay. So now, we can fill up this, we can replace the sides that have stone, and replace it with sand and start to plant the sugar cane. Do not go into the What? Show me. I don't believe you. <laughs> I've never found a golden apple in the desert temples. down here, where I'm placing the farms. Ooh, seems I've collected enough sand just from the chests alone. I found out how to drop things from the big inventory, apparently. Grab the sugar cane now. Boom, boom, boom. Oh. Put it in this chest. I need to see this. Oh my god. You weren't lying. You seriously only get one though? Well, since you found it, you can have it. You found two? Oh, well then, I guess I'll take one and you take one? Okay. Anyways, this is where the farm areas are going to be. Down in this little area we managed to make it up to when we fell down this canyon. Okay. It just needs a little bit. Of lighting up. Okay, yes, I fell down. <laughs> yes. Embarrass me on camera, please. Meal. So 
we'll throw some of these carrots up. That way we can have a decent food source at least. Apparently bone meal has a slight tendency to fail. But hey, I am getting a butt ton of carrots now. Okay, so the carrot farm is 12 slots. That's good to know. So that means 12, and carrots seem to come out in multiples of 2, 3, or 4, so... Good. Boom. Okay. No, I don't want to eat the carrots yet. There we go. I got some bones and I turned it all into bone meal. So it's okay. Fertilizer crap. And boom. I also have some string. And with that other woolen chest, I have enough to make one bed. Did you get some string from that chest you found the golden apple in? Because if so, we might have enough to make two beds. Yes? If you have four string, then that means we have enough wool to make us two beds. How much string? You can make wool out of string. <laughs> oh god, I fell down with you! <laughs> okay. Anything because it's raining and it's dark. If I remember correctly, from every time I spawn after I die, the face should be this way. Yep, I'm on the red course. Put the string instead of chest, I'll make us the bed. Creeper. Run. Other way, bro. Other way. There's a creeper. How much health do you have because you survived it? Like how many hearts? Oh, I guess I'm guessing you healed. Oh, you got the beds covered. Okay. Oh yeah, an easy way to drop stuff is to click on the item in your big inventory and just click outside the box. Click outside anywhere that's not inside the inventory screen. Your inventory is full. <laughs> Sorry. Yep, that's enough string to make us.
open up like your full inventory and if you click on the item you want to throw then don't click on anything that's in your big inventory screen you'll throw it way easier big inventory like the that 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 square And there's like a little space on the sides of the Okay, let's just go to a chest and let you put them in there. I don't know why I didn't shift click or shift walk crouch. There's my golden helmet. Some of the carrots. Wait. There's seriously only two carrots? Uh oh. Why are you placing two carrots at a time? <laughs> My map. Thank you. You can actually leave the iron in the chest because we'll share it. Okay. Oh, splitting it? Okay. I don't need any sand. I already finished the sugarcane farm. I need all the wool. Yes, my bucket. <laughs> I had some wool. The stuff that I need to use to make bed. Did you also hand me six pieces of wood planks? That way I can, uh... Do you have the wool? Did you grab everything I dropped while I was down there? Great. I'm going on a mission. See ya. I'm going out that door again. <laughs> Just to grab all my stuff. I'm actually going to put my helmet on. That way I can actually survive the fall. My helmet's actually probably going to break in the process, but... Okay. Okay. Have them here. What the heck? <laughs> I know, but this was the easiest way. <laughs> you have the wool? Where is the wool? 
get that burnt, I'm gonna be pretty mad. You know what I think happened? I think it might have landed on one of the higher ledges somehow. Because when I died earlier, it was on one of the higher ledges somehow. Like when I died right twice in a row trying to get back to my house because I fell in the canyon both times. If it burnt in the lava, I am not going to be a happy camper. Every single ledge, and so I can see if any of the wool landed there. didn't land on any of the ledges. That means the wool was probably burnt in the lava. Yeah, dang it. <laughs> you were right next. I literally died right next to you. How could it have be how could it have despawned? True. You sure you don't have the wool? Because without it, we can't make any bed. I'm actually going to get a higher look on things. Okay. So, I have the high view. Okay, so good news is it didn't magically teleport up to any high ledges. Some of the sand landed up here, on top of my house, somehow. Wait, I didn't have sand. Not in my house. It had to have landed on lava, because... These spawning rates are actually... ...pretty decent. It takes like 10 to 15 minutes for an item to despawn. <laughs> I'm also going to contain some of these water places. There we go. There's one contained. That should be easier to get around that one. Uh, this one's not going to be so easy. Oh. Oh. Here. Here. 
going to it. I'm just continuing it with the random junk I have in my inventory. I don't want to eat the carrot. In one of these corners it was floating to. No, the corners it's floating me outwards. Away from the corners. So it couldn't have landed there. Okay. I see a ledge. Not there. Right. There we go. I don't know how this water's still flowing. All I know is I hate it. Okay. I have to go. 